this is one that I just did too, uh, just to show it, like horses, animals, things you can ride, right? You interact, you get up on it, right? Um, you get up on that, the, the horse, right? If I hit triangle again, I would get off the horse, right? Um, but even like short animations, you can add a lot, you can make them interesting. Um, for this one, I just Googled reference of how to get on a horse without a saddle, because this horse didn't have a saddle. Uh, and there's a, YouTube has it all, right? It, it, and that's probably the first place I would go for reference. There's great videos of how to do things. People explain step by step how to get on, you know, how to how to how to mount a horse that doesn't have a saddle. Um, so when you're looking for reference, that's a good place to go to. This is a good example to show as well. We'll get down to the specifics. We're not doing a 30 second shot. And again, like the interacts should be quick. I would say like try to keep them eight seconds or less, right? Uh, and and I will say like 100% of the time, not even 99% of the time. A short animation that is more polished and looks good will always outshine a longer complex animation that has issues. Like short and simple does not mean bad, right? If you want to go with a shorter, simple of like character just picking up a weapon, looking at it, cocking it, right? That, that could be short, but if it's polished, doesn't have any issues, looks great, that'll look better than maybe a, a big idea that has a lot of issues, that makes sense. So simple does not mean bad, short does not mean bad. So once you get into your layout as well this week, you, you can play with and start getting an idea of like, here's my idea is how long it's taking and then start figuring out how to, how to get it down. But in the end, this, these are interact animations, right? If this was Red Dead Redemption and it took me again, 15 seconds to mount a horse, I would probably stop playing the game, right? Like you want your characters to do the things kind of quickly. But as we were looking at before, it doesn't mean you can't add a lot of interests. Here's a good example again for horses, I guess robot horses, but just all the different ways you could like mount, like all these different ways, right? There's not just one way. Just because, you know, I just showed a horse mount animation and they have some here, doesn't mean you couldn't do something like this. Just because it, just because it's been done before doesn't mean there's no more ideas for how you could do it, right? So getting it on and off, uh, you know, in and out of vehicles, on and off uh, animals that you'd be riding, right? Maybe it's a bigger, maybe you're riding a horse or something or a, a, an elephant or something. Some games will even have different interacts for like mounting if you're running versus walking, right? If I'm running full speed, maybe I'm in combat and maybe you want to do like the quick one where she hops on behind and just instantly gets on the, the horse to go. But maybe if it knows I'm walking, or I'm not in combat, like the game can tell that as well. I can play a slight 